What is up, everybody? It's me, E. Lee Lee D. Man, and today I will be reviewing Jaws 3D, also known as I get the camera fixed, also known as Jaws Camera Jaws 3. The movie begins with these people that are that are like practicing for SeaWorld. It goes and little do they know that they left the gate to the ocean open and this baby shark hold on, hold up. Baby shark baby shark baby shark Okay, for real. Let's pick you up now. Baby shark swims in right in the sea world, right into the lagoon, and the people do not know it. So you got a baby shark do 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 on your hands. Do 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 do. Chief Brody is no longer in this, but Michael, Chief Brody's son, and Sean is in this movie. Michael is going out. Well, by. Michael's girlfriend is Kelly. Kelly works at SeaWorld, you know, with the dolphins, with the orcas, with the beluga whales. And Mike is, like, one of the main technicians, the boss, whatever. But the gate is still open. And, uh, I don't know if it was the baby shark that killed this guy, but the guy that goes under the water to close the gate. Um, what's his name? What's his name? Oscar, no, not, yeah, Oscar, Overman, yeah, Overman, gets attacked by a shark, I don't know if it was the mama shark or the baby shark, but he gets eaten by a shark, because he was trying to close the gate, and there was a shark already in the gate, I believe it was mama shark, I think it was mama shark, but Mike can't believe this, they're like, where's Overman, so they go into the lagoon to find Overman, and they don't find Overman, instead, they find dolphins and a shark. The shark chases them, but thankfully you got the dolphins that, or you know, they're like on the dolphin, like the dolphins are right here, the people are right here, they're holding on to the dolphins, and the dolphins like carrying them, while the mean, no, Mr. Shark, yeah, it was the baby shark that, that was chasing them, the baby shark was like, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you, and uh, he doesn't get them, no, he doesn't get them, he doesn't even get the dolphins. Poor guy. But then Kelly comes up with this idea. Let's put a great white shark in captivity. So they do. They put in captivity. And the tank is a little touch pull tank. It's, if you ever saw Jaws 3D, they put the shark in a tank. And it the shark just flips over and dies. No wonder the shark dies, bro. That tank is little. His body, his full body is not even in the tank. The only thing that's out is his fin. It's a little touch pull tank that you can just go, Hey, me, Woody. Yeah. <laughs> you know. But Mama Shark is somehow in SeaWorld, and she doesn't like the idea of this. So, she attacks the ski show. Mama Shark does not play. Which Mama Shark, the shark, the Mama Shark from Jaws 3D, is the biggest shark is the biggest shark in any of the Jaws movies. Mama Shark, bro. Don't, I don't, mamas are always like that. Mothers are always like that. They just, they love their babies. It's so adorable. But Mama Shark thankfully gets her revenge and kills a lot of people at SeaWorld and even kills one of the guys, the governor, governor guy. So, yeah. One of my favorite parts in this movie, which I used to love it as a kid, is whenever they throw up in the control room and the shark comes right there at the glass and it goes and the entire glass breaks that the, the shark is literally like this and all it does the only movement the shark has is bending its nose up and it just hits the glass. This used to be, this used to be one of my favorite scenes in the entire Jaws franchise. But but that was because I didn't know any better. I didn't know that it was it, the movie is all right, 
It's not a bad movie. Oh, yeah, How Do They Kill the Shark? Well, one of the shark that the guy eats, he has like this bomb, okay? He has a bomb up on him. And by the end of the movie, he, the guy's still not fully swallowed. And the guy pulls the plug up on the bomb, and the shark goes... <sighs> just like that. And that's how the shark dies. But, like I was trying to say, the movie's not good. And it's not bad. It's a maybe alright movie. Some of the, th the 3D can be absolutely horrible. But some of the 3D, like Overman's arm doing this, can be really good. 3D, wow. It can be, you know, it can be really cool. And it can be really bad. But overall, I'm going to rate this with numbers a, maybe a, maybe a, since I have a long history with this movie, I'm going to name it, I'm going to do it just a five, six, or seven. I want to rate it a C plus for Jaws 3D. But if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and have a lead day. 3D. Wow. 3D. 3D. So scary.